to all of my lovely flute nerd friends and colleagues. Um, I wanted to make a video to, to share with you uh, one of the most interesting, clever and innovative um, case designs for multiple flutes. Uh, and so I just thought you'd want to have a look. Um, this, I, I just picked this one up from, from Howard Wiseman in London. Um, yesterday and I am just completely amazed by the work that he's done. Um, as you can see this is actually his violin case um, model. He's made some of the, the, the cases for the, some of the most expensive uh, violins on the planet, Stradivari, um, Guarneri, um, all, all sorts of really expensive kit. Um, and so I loved the, 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 the shape of this and I sort of challenged him as to what we could fit um, into this shape. And he has done an amazing thing. So I just wanted to show you, um, and I'll, I'll just I'll well, I'll open it up and you can have a look. So you can see that it's obviously sits quite happily on its side, and then we open it up. And so here we have um, bass flute and alto flute. Um, the this is a B-footed uh, Kingma Brown bass flute with open holes um, and things. Uh, this is a Haynes Amadeus alto flute. Uh, the stands are all also in this case. So we have um, the bass flute stand, the actual uh, carbon fibre stand for, for that goes up inside the foot joint. There's a special little slot, so that means that just slots down there. Um, likewise with the alto flute, we have a little wooden stand there for that. Um, all the joints are all suspended. Um, so nothing is touching a hard surface. Everything is, is suspended and also nothing is um, Velcroed in everything is, 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 so is held in and also blocked in as well So this would be quite impressive this, if this was just bass and alto flute, but it's not so I'm gonna add some flutes First thing I'm gonna add is piccolo Now as you can see the piccolo is in one piece um, so it just slots in there There we go and that just pops right in there. So there's the piccolo. And then also uh, we have room for a flute as well. So um, we um, this goes in here. It's a B-footed flute, flute with, again, with I've, I've got the, uh, the stand that goes there. So that just pops in like that. The body then goes in like this. And again, everything is suspended. Everything is, is, is in control. So we now have flute, piccolo, bass flute and alto flute and there's still room, there's still room. So um, I've got an E flat flute which also fits in, in one piece. And that just pops in like that. So now we have five flutes in this one um, violin sized case. Um, that weighs very little. All of the stands for all of the flutes, um, I guess not for the E-flat flute, but everything else is, is there. Um, and yeah, and so whenever you close this up, everything just gets blocked in and it's amazing and perfect. And it just, yeah, so everything is just perfectly held. Um, also, you can change the E-flat flute for a regular flute. All you have to do is remove this Velcro block and suddenly we can fit in another concert flute, fully suspended. So this would now hold two concert flutes, piccolo, bass flute, alto flute and all the stands. Um, and as I said, so whenever you close it up and you have um, locks here which are from the very finest yacht making technology so these are not going to go anywhere and we've got keys and, and everything and so there we go so we have five flutes in a case the size of a violin case um also um, because of, of hand luggage regulations and restrictions and so on uh i quite fancied the idea of having a laptop and ipad pouch as well so we've even in integrated that this goes on with poppers And then we have a Velcro securing strap. And then we can have a laptop built in 
to the case. So there we go. Um, these are going to be available, I think, from MFA. This was the very first one, and I really, I, I can't tell you, I couldn't be happier. So um, it's a really amazing development. Hope you enjoyed the video. Thanks.